Hello everyone, Dillian here. Happy Throwback Thursday, and the rotation leads us to our Bionicle review, and this one's on Tanak Call and Nuvak Call, two of the Borak Calls from 2003, of course. So on the front of the manual entry, which for just Tanak Call here, have the Bionicle logo, and picture at Tanak Call around lava, Lego logo, and also the uh, symbol of the shielding and Tanak Call there, and also, set number 8574. The front page of which shows Tonal Call which emerging from the uh, remaining Borak nests. And on the back, advertisement and for all the Borak calls and Krana calls that there are. And those two of which, which I previously reviewed for Throwback Thursday. And also, and these two of which. Yeah, these two. Oh, it's next, next throwback Thursday. So expect, so hang on for that. And also Bonkle logo and Bonkle.com, of course. And then all the bar call there, Bonkle.com, and some little uh, screenshot, or some little shots representing the storyline of it all. And a little more of that as well. And then a little step for the combination model that there is. And then of course how to emerge it or set it or cocoon it in the canister of course. And then final build process. And then final building step of the folding up process. There. First up is Tana Call, the lead Bora Call. <coughs> Which, from first glance, like all the Bora Calls, it's the same build as all the Bora previous years' Borocks, but of course, with the limbs that are the uh, main color and also a lot of silver to them. Like obviously feet, and the feet, which are the silver, and also the limb joints again in the uh, main color of the body piece now, and also the uh, hand joints, which are all in silver. And of course, for mocking, great to have there if you're to make a character with a lot of silver again. And the arm piece saying that, and also ending off with the shield piece of it. Now, as for tonic calls in particular, which kind of uh, similar to the original tonic ones, but however, still has, does have, still has flames to it, and also this little greeble kind of bit to it. Yeah. So if you are to make sense or use this for like a chest plate piece for a mock, this which well works out for that. And of course, like all the Borak Call and Borak's can press this in and put the head off like so, since it's the same build. And the which first sets to include the uh, three long rods, but in uh, like great, which carried on to all the rest of the years, of course. And as for the head part, still has the blue eyes, like the original Tana Call, of course, and for his uh, face shield piece. Yeah, face shield. Which does have a lot of red markings to it and also his uh, shield piece in it, of course. And like the others, clips open and then there's his Krana for that bud in bronze coloring and of course clip off like so. And then, and for those of you who aren't already familiar, is you can also fold right up. Oh wait, which I'll do on the back call. And I guess that is it with Tana call. Now onto the only other one for this one, Nuvak call. Which again, 
might be on the full rock hall, but where seems not there, but and obviously all black. And the limb pieces in black instead of gray, like the original Duvok white was. But then as for his shield piece, yeah, shield is here. Which does have kind of a soft blade kind of look to it. And of course, kind of a bit like Onuanuva's uh, buzz saw uh, swords that there are. Kind of works out well alongside that. And then the eye pieces, just like the other Duvok and Duvok Va, of course, in his and the face shield, which is in silver and also has that uh, shield marking in it, like the other Borak Vaz, of course. And of course, all Borak calls, which face plates were exclusive to each one of them. And it flip open, and then there's his uh, chronic, sort of a copperish kind of coloring. Well, depending on which. And of course, this which the suit, I think. And of course, yours would be a lot different, of course. And now on to the folding into a ball process like the others do. And there we go. And roll around like so. And so now on to the final verdict. Overall, I think these which are kind of good sets, uh, which for the time and also today, even though they still may be a little repetitive from the previous four rocks, well, but of course you get a lot of silver again, and also, and of course, good things about both of these sets are their very own shield pieces, whereas although Nuvok calls ones did come in a couple other sets as well, but. Kind of a shame that Tana Calls ones didn't get to be in the, any other sets. That's but whatever. And also, these were obviously good for the price point that they both were at the time of 2003. You know that may have adjusted like around 10 to 11 dollars today, but at least they're still fair as is. But yeah. And, and if any of you still have these sets from back in the day, well, I hope you had some good memories of them. And for those of you who haven't and still have access to these sets, I'd say definitely pick them up. eBay, Bricklink, Mercari, whatever. And that is it with this video. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.